Kent Williams, assistant coach with the University of Tennessee men's basketball. I have Jordan, one of our managers with us. And uh, we are going to demonstrate the chair drill and the double moves drill. First, on our chair drill, we will start on the block. And what we want to do is we want to sprint out and we're going to run to the chair. We got the ball sitting on the chair first. We'll have a coach holding it. We'll come. We do a jump stop so we're down in a strong position with a good base. Grab the ball out of the coach's hand, being strong with it. We're going to open up, and we're going to rip and go and make our move. And what we teach our guys, having a low base, when you're ripping through, you get that ball from left side to right side as hard as you can and quick. And the first one we'll do is we'll rip through, and we'll go right into a layup. And then after we do the layup, we'll mix in several different moves, which we'll show you here in just a second. So first, Jordan's going to go. He's going to rip it through. He's got a layup off one leg. Good. Now you do the same move, and you'll finish off two feet. Power move. Good. Now the third one we'll do, you got to reverse layup. Still start from the block. You'll come get it. you got to reverse layup on the other side. Good. Okay, with that same move, we can also take the ball, and we can open up go to the middle with the same three finishes. Usually we don't do the reverse layup when we go middle. Now what we're going to do is add a variation. Jordan's going to come up. He's going to grab the ball. He's going to open baseline again. He's going to take one dribble, cross it over into a pull-up jump shot. And then we'll add a between the legs dribble, behind the back dribble, and then we'll do in and out. And we'll get four different variations on his move into a pull-up jump. So here we go. Now we'll go between the legs, same move. Good. Now behind the back. And the last one is going to go in and out to the right, off the last. we do these moves, we'll do several reps of each one. We'll do those same moves also going to the middle. So we mix up where we open and come to the middle, and we also open coming come baseline. All right, so now we'll go to the double moves. And Jordan first, he's going to start about this range. This is a move that you can do in transition, or you can do it in the half court. But what Jordan's going to do, he's going to take one hard dribble at the first cone, one hard dribble, Make a tight crossover. We try to keep our crossover low and tight while you're on the move to get by your man. Now you're going to attack the second cone. One dribble, crossover again. Now you're going to come over here. You got to pull up jump shot off glass. Now, after we do the crossover, we'll do a crossover, crossover, crossover between the legs, crossover behind the back, and then crossover in and out. And then we also like to throw in a variation where you can do a crossover spin move. So, but we'll mix it in up. Mix them up and show the first four, and then maybe the last one we'll do a spin move. Cross over. Now you got to cross over between the legs. Now we'll do a cross over behind the back. Now we'll do a cross over, in and out, jump shot from the Now last we're going to do is a crossover into a spin move. These are just a few of the drills and moves that we work on with our guys to try to make them more versatile. Uh, the chair drill and the double moves are just things that give them different options. Really what the player is going to do is figure out what move he likes the best and probably go to that. We like to give them the different options so he can figure out what is his best move.